Olive Dale Ranch, goes textile. A shift to mandatory clothing marks the end of an era for Olive Dale Ranch as internal conflicts and recent tragedy expose deep divisions. By Evan Nix In a major change for Southern California's naturist community, Olive Dale Ranch RV Park and Resort announced on November 4, 2024, that it would become a clothing mandatory resort. Starting December 6, clothing will be required in all common areas, with the policy extending to all individual sites on January 6, 2025. After careful deliberation, Olive Dale Ranch RV Park and Resort has reached a decision to become a textile park, read the notice to site holders. Long known as a clothing optional haven, Olive Dale's abrupt change leaves nudist residents reeling, marking a fundamental shift from the community's historical identity. The decision comes during a turbulent time for Olive Dale, marked by legal disputes, leadership clashes, and recent tragic events. Once celebrated for its sense of freedom and community, Olive Dale is now caught in a crisis that threatens its very future. Rising Tensions and Legal Disputes the tragic deaths of Stephanie and Daniel Menard in late August 2024 have intensified existing tensions at Olive Dale Ranch, a once thriving naturist resort in Colton, California. The Menards, aged 73 and 79, were reported missing on August 25 after failing to attend church. Days later, their remains were discovered beneath their neighbor Michael Sparks' home. Sparks has since been charged with their murders. This horrific event has laid bare deep-seated conflicts that had been simmering within the Olive Dell community for years, exposing rifts between management, ownership, and long-term residents. In late 2023, the removal of longtime managers Bobby and Becky Kilburn by the new ownership team shocked and divided residents. Since then, reports of alleged harassment, eviction threats, and retaliatory actions have mounted under the new management led by Tina Kaufelt. The Menards, longtime residents, had become increasingly at odds with the new management over a series of issues. They were active participants in a class action lawsuit against all of Dell's management, alleging violations of the mobile home residency law, retaliatory evictions, and unfair business practices. The suit included complaints about alleged illegal charges and eviction threats toward residents who spoke out, underscoring the discord that had taken root within the community. The Menards were not alone in their legal struggles at Olive Dell. Several disputes have erupted involving the ranch's management, including between current and former owners, and even between the current owners themselves. The Kilburns, who had managed the resort for decades, filed a breach of contract lawsuit against the owners, including Kaufelt, co-owners Brian Cleland and Mark Glaser, and Olive Dell Management, LLC. The Kilburns allege wrongful conduct in their removal. Kaufelt's role as manager has been a focal point of contention. According to Cleland, a co-owner and former registered agent for the resort, Kaufelt assumed day-to-day -day management without his consent. Cleland asserts that Kaufelt, who provided the loan for the 2019 purchase, was not formally listed as an owner, despite her claims. Tina's not an owner, she's not a partner, even though she claims she is, Cleland told Planet Nude, voicing frustration over his diminishing involvement in the ranch's operations, adding that he has even considered legal action, I'll be filing a lawsuit pretty soon. This ongoing discord has fostered an atmosphere of mistrust, with legal battles compounding the community's grief and frustration. As Cleland pointedly noted, the Menards were longtime tenants and great people with no enemies, except Tina. The Menards filed many harassment claims against Tina. They were not friendly. A storied history now under threat. Founded by nudist pioneer Bill Keisel in 1952, Olive Dell Ranch quickly became an iconic destination, celebrating social nudity in the secluded landscape of San Bernardino County. By 1976, the Kilburn family assumed ownership, and under their stewardship, the club blossomed into a beloved community for Southern California naturists. Bobby and Becky Kilburn continued to manage Olive Dell after it was sold in 2019 to financial investors Mark Glaser and Brian Cleland, who assured residents of their commitment to keep it clothing optional. Yet, just five years later, those assurances seemed to have unraveled. The removal of the Kilburns in 2023 was a catalyst for widespread discord in the community. 
Several residents loyal to the Kilburns have since moved out, and those who remain describe a divided community with worsening conditions and a lack of familiar amenities. Allegations of mismanagement, rate hikes, and harassment have persisted, with numerous residents citing the loss of community cohesion. The decision to require clothing at all of Dell is a step away from its naturist roots. For longtime residents, the policy change symbolizes a severance from the community's once vibrant identity. At the same time, unresolved disputes continue to erode trust, with many residents worried about the park's long-term viability. This policy change reaches beyond the small community of Olive Dell Ranch and will be felt by nudists and naturists across Southern California. We hope you're enjoying Planet New. If so, please consider a paid subscription. Your membership comes with exclusive content and supports our work. Subscribe at www.planetnew.co. This episode of Planet Nude Podcast is sponsored by the Naturist Action Committee, dedicated to making naturism an accepted part of society. Learn more at www.naturistaction.org.